And still in Aquabam State, the state governor, Pastor Umo Eno, has urged cit citizens and residents to embrace peace and tolerance regardless of political affiliations. Pastor Eno, while speaking at the interdominational Thanksgiving service held at the International Worship Center in Uyo, emphasized that a harmonious society is crucial for citizens to fully reap the benefit of effective leadership. Aquabam Government House correspondent Mary Onyemichi completes his report. Uyo's atmosphere in the International Worship Center as residents and delegates from various walks of life came together to thank God for sustaining peace ahead of the state's anniversary on 23rd September 2024. Pastor Umoino congratulated everyone on reaching this significant milestone, acknowledging that his administration's successes would not have been possible without your support and cooperation. The joy we have today is that we can have all our leaders come together under one roof to worship one God who has created a Ibom, whether as PDP or whether as APC, whether as YPP, whether as any other party, we are a Ibomites first and we are bound by the love of our people. President of the Senate, Senator Goswell Akwabio, represented by his wife, Mrs. Unoma Akwabio, lauded the State House of Assembly for amending the legislation to make the Akwaibom State Traditional Rulers' Law rotational. She emphasized that the change has fostered significant unity and a sense of belonging among generations of Akwaibom children. She also conveyed the greetings of President Bola Ahmed Tenibu and the National Assembly to the government and people of Akwaibom State on their 37th anniversary, offering prayers for the state's ongoing peace unity and prosperity. Your Excellency, you're a man of God. And you know, and I know, that God Almighty preserves the godly. When you're a godly man, when you're a godly woman, don't be afraid of anything. God will preserve you. Minister of State for Petroleum, Gas Resources, Obong M.M. Eberibebo commended Governor Moina for promoting peace and unity in Akwaibom State, emphasizing that the governor has implemented critical measures to tackle the challenges confronting the state. I appreciate you for what you have done in Akwaibom State, taking everybody along, irrespective of political affiliation. I salute you for that. You are the governor at the moment like this. And I refer to you as a good shepherd for Akwaibom people. Former governor of the state, architect Victor Arta, expressed his joy and admiration for the state's rapid growth and development since its creation. He also applauded Governor Moina for his efforts in fostering unity within the state, highlighting this as a remarkable achievement. Your Excellency, I want to compliment you because you have united a quiet bomb. Nobody can ever think that this is a place that used to translate simple English news into nine different languages. I congratulate you. The guest preacher, Reverend Godwin Amauwo, admonished a quiet people to be grateful for the peace and the indices of good governance in the state describing peace as a prerequisite for prosperity and development. God has given us a man that believes in inclusivity in governance. So God bless you in the name of Jesus Christ. Politicians learn from this man after eight years. So that we, you will never take us back to Egypt. The service featured choir ministration by Government House Divine Voices, Christian Association of Nigeria Mass Choir, All Nation Christian Ministry Mass Choir, and presentation of gifts by beneficiaries of the United Kingdom Exchange Program. Mary Onyemechi, ADBN News.